Hello viewers, welcome to the second part of the song Chinnapu Chinnapu from Japanese Kalyanaraman. If you want to view the chords cover for this song, please see part one video link in the description below. In this second part, we are going to see the scale, the time signature and the chords and the strumming pattern. If you want to view the complete chords for this song, please see the description below. The scale of this song is in E minor and the time signature is 3 4. It goes like this 1 2 3 1 2 3 1 2 3 1 2 3 Chinnapu Chinnapu Kannala Mannapu Amma 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 Yennepo Kannipo So that is the time signature. The strumming pattern that I have used in my part on video cover goes like this. Down, down, up, down, up. Slow, down, down, up, down, up. Super slow, down, down, up, down, up. With the actual tempo of the song. Chinnapu, chinnapu, kanala manapu. So that is the strumming pattern. We will now see the list of chords used in this song. The first chord is E minor. The next chord is B major. The next chord is C major. The next chord is C major 7th. So in C major chord, please remove your index finger and strike all the strings. That is C major 7th. The next chord is B 7th. So it goes like this. 4th string, 1st fret, 5th string, 2nd fret and 3rd string, 2nd fret. Strike all the strings. That is B 7th. The next chord is A minor. Next chord is D major. The next chord is G major. For beginners, if you are finding it difficult to hold the back chord, you can use the open style. That is G major. We will now see Pallavi chords line by line. For the first line, Chinnapu Chinnapu. The first chinnapu is E minor, the second chinnapu is B major. The reason we have a B major chord for the second chinnapu is the bass note played behind is a B with an E flat. So we have a B major chord. The next line, Kannalam Vannapu. Kannalam is C major 7th, Vannapu is E minor. The next two lines very similar to the first two lines. So we will now see the first four lines of the Pallavi. Chinnapu, chinnapu. The next four lines of Pallavi. Ilavenil Kalam. Ilavenil is E minor. Kalam is A minor. The next line very similar. So we will see those two lines. The next line, Inbatai Ali Irekum. Inbatai is E minor, Ali Irekum is B seventh. So, Inbatai Ali Irekum. The last line, Sorgatin Andapuram Iduvo. So, Sorgatin is C major, Andapuram Idu is B major, Vo is E minor. So, the last line, Sorgatin Andapuram Yedu. It goes like that. So we will see the last four lines of Pallavi and see how it ties to the first line. Okay, 
So that is the end of Pallavi chords. We will now see the Pallavi chords with the slow tempo of the strumming. So that is the end of Pallavi chords. We will now see Charanam chords line by line. We will see the first three lines of Charanam because the next three lines is very similar to the first three lines. Poovella Mauna is fully G major. Bashaigal Pesa. Bashaigal is D major. Pesa is G major. Non Yenna Solla. Non Yenna is G major. Solla is D major. Then we have the Ho. For the first part of the Ho, it is G major. When it drags, it is a C major chord. It is clearly heard when you hear the song. So we will see those three lines together. Repeats for the next three lines. The next four lines very very simple. Two simple chords G major and C major. For the first word is G major, second word is C major. The next line Kodai Narkalil. Kodai Narka is E minor, Lil is B major. The next line very similar. Kodai Narka The next line Kartrum Poom Dan is D major. Kadal Pate continues with D major. Padum is G major, Vasanda Veda is B major. So we will see from Kodai Narkali. Kodai Narkali Kaman Pandi Gai Kaatrum Poom Dan Kadal Pate Padum Vasanda Veda goes to Pallavi. We will now see Charanam chords with a slow tempo of the strumming. So that is the end of Charnam Chords. I hope you find this video tutorial easy to follow. Thank you for watching.